Now, hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna be smoking some baby back ribs. So we're gonna pull these out of the package here. It's about $10, we got three and a quarter pound worth of ribs. So we're gonna slide these bad boys out of the package. We're gonna get them seasoned up. And then, we're gonna put them on the smoker. So let's see what we got here. Yeah. All right, so for our seasoning, we use a dry smoking rub. Hopefully you can see that. It's for uh, beef, pork, chicken. Has a picture of ribs on it, so we're gonna try it. We got a little bit of the brown sugar. We're gonna put on there, but before we put seasoning on, we gotta take the little film off the back. Inspect it. Now there's a little bit right there. We gotta get that film off there. We gotta get that little film off there. All right, so the silver skin, is on the back here, and you're gonna wanna pull that off. Just like that. It kinda of broke apart. We're gonna pull it off like that. So. Look at that. silver skin we do not need that you don't want it actually you want to take it off before you cook because it is a pain in the butt all right all right now that we got the silver skin debacle situated we'll go and bring the camera a little bit closer we're gonna check this out we're gonna season it up all right so what we have here is our rub Take our little rub, put it all over there. Look at that. Man, look at that. That's really sharp looking. Rub that in. Like a dry rub. Put some on the back. You never know. On the edges, very important to put some rub everywhere. Rub it down. Rub and rub and rub it. Rub and also give me a thumbs up. Rubbing it down. So, now we got that rub down. All right, so we got the rub on there. So let's go outside, check out our fire. All right, so we got some, got some smoke coming out of the old smoker. Let's see what our temperature says. 240 not bad all right all right so what we're gonna do is we're gonna put it in the smoker for a couple hours and then we're gonna take and put it over here for a couple more hours at about 225 250 it's gonna look sharp all right guys so we just got finished putting some brown sugar on here Get that out a little bit so i pour some brown sugar on here from my parchment paper and uh, we're gonna put it on the smoker inside this paper. I'm not gonna wrap it up really tight. Just kind of fold it over like that, just like such. We're gonna let it smoke for a couple hours. All right, guys. Let me show you what we got. Show you what we're working with. Woo! Look at all that wonderful smoke in there. So up on top. That's where I got my ribs. Right inside there. It's, it's real loose in there. Real loose, it's gonna look sharp. Close her down. And for the fire, we're using apple chunks. Applewood chunks on the ribs. We're gonna smoke in here for a few hours. We're gonna come over here to this bad boy. And I just put mesquite lump charcoal. Put it in there, and then, and then, in a few hours, we are going to start. Actually, I'm going to start that in about an hour. Let it get real hot. Let that smoke over there. Put it in here. This is going to be red hot coals. I'm going to char the outside of those ribs with that dry rub. And it's going to be amazing. Trust me. Trust me on this. It's going to be amazing. All right. Let's see what we got here. Oof. 
carried over here. Alright guys, that's where we're at. Just took this off from the smoker. A little bit harder than I wanted it to be. Looks pretty good. So now we're going to put it on here. It's probably going to flame up real good, but that's fine. Get all that juice. We need that juice. Looks good. So, I headed over here. It was a little over three hours. I put on here for just a little bit. I actually want it to kind of flame up. I want it to flame up and char it real good. I like that char. Alright guys. Usually, I like it just to be dry like that. But, I'm going to try this barbecue sauce called Stubbs. Original legendary barbecue sauce. I'm gonna put a little bit on and rub it down with this little guy. Oh, that's too much. That's too much. That's too much. Let's rub it in. Just rub it in. That's a whole lot. This looks like we're about to make a Burger King commercial. Oh, yeah. Going out. Everywhere. Ooh. That'd be a good thumbnail right there. Mm. So we're gonna close the lid and let that cook for a little bit longer. Ooh, there it is, guys. Look at that. Has that nice char on it, just like I like it. Just like I like. Let's come over here. Man, that's good. Let's flip her over. See what she'll do. Ooh, charred. I like it. Let's put it over here. Oh, man. Alright, guys. Here it is. Look at that. Look at that pretty little thing right there. Alright. Let's bring this camera in here and we'll get some good shots of it. Alright, there it is everybody. Look at that beauty. Alright, let's keep this knife right here and let's cut her in half and let's find out what happened. Alright, let's cut it right here. I was trying to cut right into that daggone bone there. That ain't gonna work. Alright, let's see what we got. Let's see what that looks like. Ooh, that's hot. That's hot. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, let's peel it apart. So I need to get my towels. The towels out here, just in case. Let's pull this guy apart. Mm. I like that little char. It's a little bit more charred on the bottom than what I wanted. Got good color there. A little bit more charred than what I wanted on the bottom. But, coming right apart. Mm -mm. All right. Okay, everybody. Let's see what happens. Mm -hmm. Real good flavor. Real good. What type of quality you get on quality content, Rick? Top part, cook perfectly. Bottom part, kissed by the flame. A little bit more cooked, but it's okay, I'm not selling it. Um, all in all, it's pretty good. Pretty good stuff. So let's see what this piece looks like right off the bone. Coming right off the bone, Michael Scorsese. It's juicy. Yeah. I'd say it's a success. That's real good. Please give me a thumbs up. Put some comments in there. If you have something better to say, say it. Um, 
Yeah, it's really good. Y'all should stop by someday. Try it with me. It's really good stuff, guys. I really appreciate you stopping by. Look at that. Give me a little thumbs up, guys. Share it with your friends, with your buddies, compadres. Really appreciate it. Thanks for stopping by.